folks. Welcome back to JTO Mally 96810Ps. I'm your host, JTO Mally 9681, and we are currently playing Space Invaders for the Atari 2600. I had trouble trying to do this one before, and so, um, this is one of the really old games that came out in the arcade. Yeah, and the arcade was released in 1978 in Japan, and then was later released on the Atari 2600 in 1980. So, you just have to go around and you have barriers that could kind of help protect you. You can shoot through the barriers, uh, aliens can shoot through them, you can have settings that, you know, you got moving barriers, you can't shoot through the barriers, and you have dual ships and stuff like that. You have invisible mode, which I don't like invisible modes just because I can't see anything. <laughs> I just hate, I just really hate that. If I can't see anything, I just can't get into it. So we're going to stay on the first setting, and let's get started. Sorry, folks, I had the volume down too low. This would be better. Oh, yeah. Ah, I waited way too late. these games. Well, I don't hate this game. I like this game, but I don't like it when they have games that have Oh, yes. That it that the bullet has to go all the way off the screen or hit an enemy before you can actually get another one off. Get another shot off before Is this like the uh, third or fourth screen now? Oh, that! Whoa! Did I hit that UFO? Oh, that was a cheat! Yeah, and if they land on the ground, it's over. That was cheap right there, man. That's not right. 2,425 points, it looks like. Let's try this one more time. There's that UFO again. Oh, 
Oh, I got another one. You know, when I was downloading ROMs for uh, the MAME, there was one racing game that I was trying to find. I hope you, I hope anybody who watches this can under can rem can remember uh, figure out what I'm talking about. You're kind of like in a go kart, and uh, you could shoot these. Uh, I'm on the second screen here. Like yellow balls at your opponent, and I think it like just slows them down. And you were in one of those sitting down racing cabinets, like you were in an actual car or something. And if somebody was behind you and shot a, like one of those yellow balls at you, you can actually feel it within your, you can actually, uh, the seat like kind of bounces or, or it kind of jerks to make it feel like, uh, you, that you've been hit, that your car's been hit. And I cannot remember the name of it. And I can, and I'm not sure if, if I can even get it for the meme. I wish I could, because I used to play that in the arcades all the time. And I think the driver that you control it, or the or the the first driver that you can that that is controlled, may, for like you know like player one it was uh, Lewis I think was his name. And I know I'm not going to be saying this correctly as it did in the arcade. But um. But it's, but then it said, like if you would win first place, your driver will jump out of the little go kart and raise his arm up in victory. And it's, and and the announcer says something, says something kind of like this: "Loose wins." Hosting opponent, something stands last, or something like that. Anybody who can remember anything like that within the arcade of a racing game like that, let me know what the name of it is, if you can remember. I would love to get that ROM, so I can at least play it on that once again, because I miss that game so much. I have not seen that arcade in the game in a long time. It was one of my favorites. And I'm not really a racing uh, fan. Not with a race, and uh, there aren't that, that that many racing games that I really like. So, ah! Oh! <laughs> oh man, I lost again. Now, nah, well. Well, folks, I hope you enjoyed it. This was Space Invaders for the Atari 2600. And I hope to see you all in my further Let's Plays. It's JTML9681. See you next time.